dear students in this video we are going to see the working of transistorized ignition system a transistor interrupts a relatively high current carrying circuit that is it controls high current in the collector circuit with less current in the base circuit therefore a transistor is used to assist the work of a contact breaker hence this system is known as transistorized ignition system okay let us see the construction it consists of a battery a ignition switch a transistor uh, that is a collector emitter contact breaker ignition coil distributor and spot plugs the emitter of the transistor is connected to the ignition coil through a resistor a collector is connected to the battery okay okay the cam in the distributor is rotated by the engine it opens and closes the contact breaker points when the contact breaker points are closed a small current flows in the base circuit of the transistor a large current flows in the emitter or collector circuit uh, of the transistor and the primary winding of the ignition coil due to the normal transistor action a magnetic field is set up in the primary winding of the coil when the contact breaker points are open when the contact breaker points are open the current flow in the base circuit is stopped the primary current and the magnetic field in the coil collapse suddenly due to immediate reverting of the transistor to the non conductive state it produces a high voltage in the secondary circuit this high voltage is directed to the respective spot plugs through the rotor of the distributor the high voltage produces a spark when it is tried to jump the spark plug gap it ignites the air fuel mixture in the cylinder so this is the working okay let us see the advantage it increases the life of contact breaker points it gives high ignition voltage it gives longer duration of the sparks and it has very accurate control of timing by the same it needs very less maintenance some of the disadvantages are more mechanical points are needed similar to a conventional system and it has a tendency to side track so this question will be asked in 8 marks or 7 marks in ana university examinations the chances of uh, asking uh, this question in 13 marks is very less if this question is asked in ana university examination you have to draw the circuit diagram this circuit diagram construction working advantages and disadvantages so prepare well thank you